Good morning, everybody. Orin J here with another War of the Visions video, and it's dark, it's early, it's Wednesday morning. Final Fantasy VIII is finally here. We've got a heck of a patch to go over as well. Look, this patch, the official launch of the Worldwide patch, is so much of what the road to Worldwide could have been that if you've been waiting for a really good patch, here it is. So let's go over this patch. Let's start where we always do with the daily purchase bonus. And I'll just say, if you're buying Amazon coins, use on the Amazon version, please do consider using my Amazon coin affiliate link for your coins or any vacuum cleaner, whatever that you purchase. Not a sponsored video, but y'all who use that link really do uh, help me out in what I do here. Now, let's go over this reward. First of all, first good thing is the whale bonus is generic Final Fantasy VIII Mind Sphere. So they did not lock this to Squall. If you are somebody who is only building Renoa this week, but maybe you want to pull for Irvine next week, so you want to pick up some Vizior in the shop, well, hey, you can do that today. Use those Mind Spheres for Renoa, and then not worry about the daily bonus for the rest of the week if you don't want to. However, the daily bonus every day is really good. Two Rainbow Balls, an Antler on day two, two Blossoms on day three, 40 scrolls on day four. So just those first four days. I mean, this is a great, this is how this should look. Like this looks correct. They got this one right. Let's move on. Okay, banners next. You no, know no, we gotta do that. Let's do the banners last. The banners are gonna take a minute. There's a lot of banners there. Instead, let's look at the shop next because they did update the special shop for the worldwide version. We have a Vizior Pack H. Okay, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. This needed to be here. This was like a must. We have a discounted Vizior Pack right here. So if you want to get that whale purchase bonus, you could get 6,000 paid for $46. 6,000 paid is more than enough to clear that bonus. You could also, again, if you're building Irvine or you're pulling for Irvine next week, you could wait to see what next week's uh, big you know, whale purchase just bonuses and pick that up then these end in 20 days so there you go there's that now the xl pack plus this is the one that i think is probably the least good it's exp cubes gill snappers ovalite and about 2500 paid viz for 40 dollars. that's the one i like the least the dollar shardless pack i mean it's fine this is a great uh if you need to do your one dollar purchase on one of the days this will get you a purple shardless so that's fine and then these special starter packs i always think these are great if for nothing else than these burst pots with some paid viz and all the other goodies so that's the paid packs today. I think the XL Pack Plus is the only one I don't love. The rest of them I like a lot. Take some of that paid viz and buy out the Final Fantasy VIII shop. Everything in here, obviously worth getting. EXP cubes, you know, Broadstone and uh, Magicite. You got a ton of rainbow materials, all for eight viz or eight gill in, with the uh, Energy Restore Large. Okay, the shops. Now, here we go. We've got the Final Fantasy VIII shop. You have a lot of stuff going on in here, and some of it you're going to want to skip. So, first of all, 300 paid tickets. You do have a 300 paid ticket for Squall right here. I think that's a pickup for everybody. You also have a 300 paid ticket for Renoa, who we're going to have to look at her banner, see if, like, Squall's on there, or, like, why you would want to do this. You do get all the rest of these goodies for 300 paid, which isn't bad, but you get Renoa. Renoa has a free banner. We'll see that here in a minute. So, you don't need to buy this ticket to pull for her there's also the 3,000 paid um normal banner tickets where you get 4,000 viz worth of pulls plus the elemental mats cubes for 3,000 paid those are fine but once again don't buy renoas don't buy renoas right there there's the training packs here you get 80 shards 10 rainbow vision spheres for 2,000 paid squall and renoa both have one of those and if you're building renoa in this case you can go ahead and get renoas for that okay we also have our free shards every day for squall renoa and the new vision card so make sure you are picking those up on the daily there we go and then otherwise the rest of the shop pretty standard now another great shop is the worldwide version celebration shop there are daily packs you can buy in here that are really awesome so for 300 page you can get 120 ur scrolls every day this is something i'm really considering doing because i'm gonna i'm about to burn all my scrolls on my main account which broke this morning like the google play uh store on windows won't launch or uninstall the game right now so i'll have to figure that out but that's why i'm on the baby j account right here anyway 120 scrolls a day for 300 paid that's good so i like that a lot 
Um, and I'm probably picking this up on the main account every day to maybe also fully reincarnate like my Elia or something along those lines. Speaking of reincarnating units, this is a great one. 300 paid for 20 generic mind spheres and 100 EXP cubes. Generic mind spheres, this is a big deal for people who want to like maybe transcend an old collaboration unit that they ran out of shards for. These are a great thing to have in the bank. So yes, paid Vizior can be tight and I understand that. But if you have paid, I think both of those packs are worth it if you're thinking about it. Now, limited packs, like only one of them. This is a good one. 300 paid is going to get people a lot of rainbow materials that they need. Keep in mind, collect your present from Hiroki before you think about buying this because there's a lot of this stuff in that present. Okay, then we have the Worldwide Version Unit Training Pack. 300 paid will get you 300 elemental fragments and 300 awakening prisms. I think this is worth, but again, a lot of that in the presence. And then we have the UR Unit Transcendence Deluxe Pack. This is really good as well. It is 80 select unit mind sphere tickets. Goes all the way to Elia right here. So 80 select mind sphere tickets. Then you also get an antler. You also get 100 scrolls. You also get five fragments and 10 vision spheres. Very much worth it. The old, I mean, I, I like every one of these packs. Just make sure you need them before you just like go nuts and buy everything. Next up this shop so for free every day we're gonna get energy restores and chocobo tickets so make sure you're picking that up we also get a ur antler for gill yes sir i will take that every single time and then these packs are different today and they're good so worldwide version plus pack 1000 free viz will get you another antler and elemental materials that's great uh ur transcendence pack 500 viz will get you 100 ur scrolls plus EXP cubes, rainbow, and gold. You can buy that up to three times. So for 1,500 viz right here, you can get 300 scrolls. There are a lot of ways to get scrolls today. So a good opportunity to reincarnate your squall if you're doing that like me, and maybe even another old unit. Okay, vision card training pack plus, that's fine. We get that one all the time. You are unit transcendence unlocking pack. So 3000 viz will get you one antler and some rainbow mats. Don't like that nearly as much as I like, you know, this pack right here, but you can buy that one multiple times if you want to. Um, you are unit transcendence pack is scrolls for 500. I was thinking there was another one on here that I like too. It might be in, hmm, where, oh no, it's in the banners. Okay, so that's those shops right there. Now let's go ahead and check out the banners because there's a lot going on here. So first of all, a lot of free pulls to do today. Um, we have the once a day free pull. So this will log in every day, do this pull. Then we have a free 100 times pull with five URs guaranteed. So that's awesome. Then there's a, another banner that we didn't know about that's really good as well. So let's take a look at this one. It's a little bit confusing. So worldwide version, 40 UR unit mind sphere times five and 25 UR vision card times five guaranteed. So it's a 10 pull. Five of those 10 are 40 UR unit mind spheres. The other five are 25 UR vision card shards. So it's duplicates of units and duplicates of vision cards times 10, but five and five. Um, and you get to do that twice. Also, you get 100 scrolls on the first pull and an antler on the second pull. This is a great banner. Now, if you're somebody like my main account, this is not a great banner because I don't really need like a large majority of a lot of different things. But on like my alt account, this is a great pull to do because I'm working on so many units and so many vision cards. I would like for it to have had a retry. It does not, but it's still a very good banner. You can do that three times. You can do that up to three times if you want. So it's it's definitely sucking some Vizior out of you, but what are you saving it for, right? That could that answer could be the anniversary where we get more banners, so keep that in mind as well. Now, next up, more banners. This is a paid banner, so it's 2,000 paid. One time only, 10 URs guaranteed 50 pull. Now, what that means is you are doing, it's 2,000 viz, you get five multi-pulls out of that 2,000 viz, and 10 of those are guaranteed to be URs, and you'll probably catch some other URs in there as well. If we look at the drop rates on this thing, you'll see that there are 100 cost units in there right here. So like, yo, King Ma in there, yo, Elias in there, all of that. 
Then if we scroll way down even further, you will see that there are 90 cost uh, vision card espers in those. So your dark Odin, uh, dark Ifrit, dark Siren, all the way up to her. So good pull right there. This is a good pull if you have some paid. Then a select UR unit guaranteed 10 pull. So it's a 2000 paid, 100 cost units are selectable in here. Now I don't think Aliyah is in here. I believe Aliyah is not. Let's see if I click 10 pull, um, how at the heavens blade is right there but i don't think our new you are a liar if these are in order which i'm not sure that they are i i looked earlier and didn't see a liar in here so i don't think you could get her still any of these units if you want one of them and don't have them it's a good banner if you want to pick one of those up two thousand paid then this is maybe my favorite one of all for older accounts. It is a select UR vision card guaranteed times 10. Now, when I first clicked on it, I was like, oh man, no dark El dark, dark espers, but they pull the fast one on themselves. You gotta scroll the bottom right here. Here's your dark espers, dark Odin, dark Ifrit. Now dark siren, the brand new one, not on here. That's unfortunate, but dark Bahamut, my God, does this account need dark Bahamut in a bad way. Dark Golems on here, Anima's amazing, Bahamut. I, like, it's really hard for me to pick which one of those I'm gonna end up doing on Baby J's account, but only one time you can go get those things, there it is. Then let's go ahead and look at, here's how you get Renoa. It's a 10 pull free Renoa guaranteed. So just go get your Renoa and get off to the races. That's great. Um, uh, and it's cool that she's on a 10 pole instead of just in the rewards. So you get to see the walkout animation and you might catch something else. Now, I I'm just gonna guess that Squall's not on here. Guys, I didn't actually look but I'm pretty dang sure Squall is not going to be on this banner as well. So we get to the 100 cost Elias on here. You can catch yourself in Elias. Okay, Squall's not, but still get your Renoa for free. Then here's your regular banner for Squall. This, if you want to do the pity bar route, this is the way to go. It's a true pity bar, which means 5% at a time. Once you max it out, boom, there's your unit. Take your coins to the shop trade them in for shards so i know a lot of people do like to do this banner and then they like to buy those like tickets in the shop and use them here so that's an option here's Renoa's banner she's free go pull her on this banner right here but if you do have a ticket for her or something that's where you'll use it then here's the regular banner for squall's vc don't pull on this one because there's better banners for him okay squall he does if you want to go the coin pity route which is an option squall does have the the two times three step banner that guarantees him some shards so these will give you those pity coins on every step. First one is discounted. MR plus guarantees with Squall shards guaranteed on the third step. I really like those. This is typically the way I go. Renoa has a nine step banner. Again, not sure why you're pulling on this. Um, Squall's drop rates are, uh, well, he's not boosted on here. So that would be the only reason to do it. But stay away from that unless you just like I don't know. Maybe somebody in chat can tell me a reason to do that. There's much, much better banners. Here's speaking of much better banners. You could do this one twice. So the Mindsphere banner, the 80 Mindsphere banner is here. You can pull it two times. Now, if we look at the drop rates for the new units, they are both on, both on their boosted rate. Renault is at 0.8%. Squall's at 0.4%. Excellent. Excellent, excellent, excellent. A great place to start if you're going for Squall. You're gonna need these Mind Spheres for him and Renoa. And here's 160 Final Fantasy VIII Mind Spheres, 2,000 pay to pop. That's great. Okay, one time only Seed of Fate Death. There's, this is the Squall five-step vision card banner. It's pretty normal, right? Now there are paid banners as well. Squall has a three step or five step paid, normal setup here with those free pulls in the middle, and then Squall shards guaranteed at the end. Renoa has one as well. Don't pull on this for the, all of the same reasons we've always said. Um, Squall also has a uh, one-time only you are guaranteed five pull for 500 with that uh, you know 2% bonus. I don't like those. Renoa has one as well. This one's interesting because on an older account, again, like Baby J's account, this is 80 UR Mind Spheres. You could do it two times. Now it is paid Vizior, but you're also guaranteed five URs on the pull. This, as far as like paid Vizior banners go, I don't think this is one of the better ones that we've had, but if it's like, say your Baby J's account, right? And you're building Renoa. And you're like, okay, I'm going to need these Mind Spheres. I'm going to need all of them I can get. I could come here, do this pull a couple of times, right? Then go do my select 
vision card esper that i need because what if i did the select vision card esper first picked dark bahamut did this got dark bahamut i'd be kicking myself sure those shards for the for the vision card would be nice but i'm really going for the esper and then there's also the 1000 paid you know two percent chance for squall's vision card right there what i will say about this one right here the two percent chance for squall it's only 500 paid which is better but you're only getting 50 pity medals so i just don't like how you only get halfway there okay so anyway that's the banners there's a lot of banners to talk about today then the shops so it's pretty standard stuff right here here's where you coin pity squall or get his shards here's where you get your shards for your vision card here's the event shop so make sure to start farming that event so we get that uh you know, 1 billion or 10 billion energy used campaign. Use a bunch of energy so we get all the rewards for that. Nothing extra special to get in here. Make sure you're getting your scrolls, you know, all the rare stuff. Just farm the heck out of the event. It's a month long event. We'll accomplish our goals, I think. And guys, that's it for the video. I was thinking about doing Baby J's polls on the end of this video, but it's already at 16 minutes. So I'm gonna stop right there. That's the banner review. Um, Good luck on your polls today, y'all. I'll be live after school, like always, big polling day. So look forward to seeing you there. I'm gonna go fix my main account so I can actually poll today. I wanna get that fixed before I go to work. Thank y'all for watching. Have a good day and I'll catch you next time. Peace.